I think I'm losing my voice. Ha, that means you can't yell at me anymore. So, uh, turns out Schlatt is scarier when he's quiet. Where's Ghostbur? Is he in you? Oh, Ghostbur, I know him. He's right here. Locked away inside. And I can hear him whimpering. That poor pathetic thing. I want a friend who is top on the line. Organized, graceful. Whoa. Oops. Oh god. I want this one. Boys, where are you two? Quackity, Sapnap? Uh, Sapnap, what are you doing? And where is Quackity? Did he? It always ends like this. This Carl, everyone forgets about us. Forget about me. Dream, bad boy, halo, now Quackity? Who's gonna be next? George? You? Will you forget about me too, Carl? Hey, big man! What's up? I thought you were gonna play with George and Sapnap today. No, Sapnap is with dad doing some demon stuff. What about George? His dad can't come out with him today and he can't leave on his own until he's 16. It's unfair. I miss him. I don't want his dad to always be there and watch us. Until he's 15? Oh, you don't like Uncle Sam. I like him, it's just that I like George too and when Uncle Sam is around, I can't play alone with George. Cause he always has to see what George is doing. Is that so? Uncle Sam is very protective of him. He doesn't want George to get hurt or dirty. He can't get sand on his shoes. We can't do anything fun. We can't play football cause we'll kick each other. We can't climb the tree cause we will fall. We can't even ride a bike together. I start to think I shouldn't leave myself too. No honey, you can and you should. Maybe George is already eight. Alright, I have an idea. We will have a small walk today with Sam and George later. I guess at least I can see him. But let's make a plan. During the walk, you're allowed to do anything you want, okay? You can go have fun, get sand and rocks in your shoes, climb a tree, whistle, whatever you goes. Okay, but why mom? You will see, duckling. Such a nice afternoon for a walk. Thanks for taking us out. George, don't run off too far. It's a pleasure and boys seem to be having fun. Hey Sam, I heard that George is not allowed to leave on his own. He's already eight. Why? Of course he's not. He's still a little boy. There are so many things that can hurt him, Puffy. He can scratch his knees, get infections, injuries. He can get sick or break his leg or his spine. I can't let him go once alone until he is more responsible. But kids learn that way, Sam. Sometimes they have to get zapped to learn to never put their finger in the socket. Sometimes I feel like you're just nuts. Why not teach them not to hurt themselves at all? I can't believe you don't see that you're the only thing hurting him the most, Sam. Look at him, he's already eight. He won't always be your little boy. He will slowly part from you. Take a good look at him. Who's more scared of getting hurt? Him or you? Me. Hmm, it's you. He can always run after him, hold his hand. George needs contact with his friends. Go out with them sometimes. Have sleepovers, some private time. He won't always be your three years old baby boy. He can hold in your arms and rock in his sleep. But I'm scared. I, I don't want to see his tears. It breaks my heart. I, I need to keep him safe. I promise I will. Oh Sam, you can't have a kid and expect no crying. You can't shield him from every single thing. Someday he won't cry because he scratched his knee. Sometimes he might cry of broken heart. What will you do then? G George! Don't, just observe. 
You okay, George? That was a nasty fall. I'm fine. I think it scratched my elbow, though. Let's go. Did you really have to climb up that high? There was such a big pretty butterfly up there. It was huge. See, my dear Samuel, it's not about teaching your kid how to never fall. It's about teaching them how to get up. How did you get arrested? I don't know. We didn't do anything wrong. When the cops pulled us over and said papers, he said scissors and drove away. So, because of your, um, eyelid situation, I got you an eye mask. Please use it. Your eyes are creepy. Okay. Shush, come on, we have to hurry. Won't we get into trouble? Not if we aren't caught. Besides, I really want to show you this place. Aha, there is it, boo. Holy crap, dream. It's so, I know, so beautiful.